Hi everyone. So before I begin telling you and giving you some a lot of academic information, I would first tell you who am I and why I am doing this. So on YouTube, on various platforms, you have a lot of knowledge, a lot of content already available. But first I'll begin with who am I, why am I here and what will you get? when you're here. So I'm basically an MBBS graduate. I've graduated from Maulana Azad Medical College in Delhi and uh, I have appeared in this year's NEET PG 2023 and the INICT, the May session 2023 and this was my internship attempt. So along with internship, I've done decent. I've scored a rank of 188 in NEET PG and 184 in the INI. Now getting ranks or uh, getting uh, a seat is not important. It is definitely important, it is our aim, but the point here is that how some people are able to do it more than the rest in the limited time because each of us has the same time, but how are some people able to do it, whereas some need to wait and they figure out later. So I'll just be sharing my own experience and the only thing that sets you apart is how you can read in less time because content is there with everyone. Everybody has made their own notes. A lot of you have. Even if you haven't, it's not late at all. You can still do fairly well with limited information as I will be providing. So just a disclaimer that I'm not a master in any of these subjects yet. So what I'll be teaching is basically not not content or query concept because I'm not sure a lot of you might grasp the concepts from what I teach but that's absolutely fine basically I will be teaching you technique technique is one thing that I will be focusing on because the most important question that I've been receiving of late is I have my content but how to concise it how to make it small that is the major question how to concise the amount of knowledge you have at this point so that it can be revised multiple number of times so this is the only thing that I will be doing there is a lot of content I would just teach you how you can put it in smaller bits and pieces so that it can be done n number of times rather than reading this one block one time you can make small and concise things which I will help you in several several times right this is my aim so who will benefit the maximum not definitely someone from my videos if you see them for the first time if you've never read the topic before it will be very difficult to understand but somebody who has read the topic and understood it roughly but does not know how to make it function how to make that information function for a competitive exam so you are at the right place so you will know how to make your information function for a competitive exam and do well how to read that information in less time how to revise and how to definitely make the concepts and the information concise. Now concise information is important definitely for the competitive exam but I feel I did fairly well in my profs and I feel that concise information is definitely important for profs as well because you have one brain and this brain can hold limited amount of information whether it be for a competitive exam or a prof paper. So if you have that concise information, you can definitely build up stories, build up on stuff and write theoretical answers as well. So this is the only thing that I will be focusing at. There are diverse topics in the medical field which are related as well. There are several interrelated topics and I will be just telling you where the connections are and how you can put it in few pages. Now in a lot of my videos, I will be using a book known as First Aid, which is uh, primarily for a USMLE preparation but it has a lot of information which is concise so if it is concise it solves my purpose so I will be add I have already added the previous year questions in all of this in my first state so I will be showing you pages and I will be taking that reference and helping you make tables and concise information so that is basically my aim of coming here and putting up some content for you thank you